I would like, if I may, to take you on a strange journey. All righty. We finished our day. We are going to try and get home. We have to put the upload probably it'll be on four maybe five i'm going to try and keep it down to four parts but we'll see how that works been uh doing upholstery repairing computers and uploading and editing videos today and that looks like that'll what'll be happening tomorrow as well but i also have to charge the air conditioner system on my sister's car and possibly check some wires and stuff out on the gopher so it's going to be fun, exciting, never-ending adventure, life. See how the gopher runs, see if she'll let us get home. Let's ride. surgery on that hitch the receiver has vibrated enough I welded that plate so that it, uh, in there so it wouldn't m move around but the problem is that receiver itself on the opposite side from where the weld is is wearing a groove in it so it's starting to vibrate a lot and that's too much hammering on that support so I'll try and get that fixed but that's for tomorrow or another day see ya the next day. Alrighty, we're gonna go in on our day off and uh, try and finish working on composing and editing. Uh, we've got two of them up. The last one I ran from home here. I got it done, brought it home to upload it. It took 13 hours to upload. <laughs> My internet service here is really, really slow. So we're gonna go ahead and go back in. I still have some upholstery work to do. I've got my tools for that. And uh, we'll do what we can and then later. There's always a continuation to a story. So we're gonna get running. Let's ride. hiccups no glitches every day's an adventure you never can tell she's a, a little finicky but I love her I'm gonna go in here and do my thing y'all take care of each other and do your thing see ya many hours later already we finished our day it is time to get home it is getting late we had to stay over and do a little bit on the video stuff had a busy day with people from schools and organizations had to sadly notify them that the prices are having to go up because we are losing money every day now. Um, been doing it for years and years and years at the cost of uh, $5 for one hour and uh, 
it's just uh, it's just not able to be done anymore like that. The heat goes up, the electric goes up, the price of parts goes up, gasoline goes up, everything goes up. Can't keep functioning and running and doing and whatever for basically nothing because it's no longer a flat line. We're going into a red, and since I don't have any other income, not that I don't get paid for this. That's the problem. I'm having to scrounge money to try and keep this afloat, but we'll do what we can. We'll see what we can work out, and uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> so, let's ride. Next day. Alrighty, we're gonna start our day. We've got the windshield and all the frost scraped off on the outside. We're getting the fogginess evaporated on the inside. We're gonna see how she's gonna run. Oh, that should be good enough. Let's ride. finished our day, worked over quite a bit, done some video stuff. Now we're out in the parking lot with drunks that can't drive, but that's normal for this area. This gentleman over to my left here, you can't see him, but he's tried to park this, back this vehicle up three different times, and he just is not accomplishing nothing. He may even run into the building. That happens every now and then. He's going for the fourth time trying to back up. And now they're going to try and just pull into a different one. And there you go. Well, I'm going to get out of here and get home before I get tangled up in some of these crazinesses. Necessitases. Let's ride.
made it home. A little bit of an excursion there with the gentleman pulling out with no lights on and just pulling out. So I'm going to get in here and get some rest, get some chow, get up tomorrow and hopefully be able to do it all again. See ya! The next day. Alrighty. We have been running around all day. We changed the oil in the gopher. So that's good because she was starting to tick a little bit. The oil had lost all of its viscosity all tack because I had to put in some of that and I hate it and I don't like doing it but I had to put in some of that uh, stop leak to swell the gaskets up. So she's moist and seeping everywhere but still rideable. Uh, it was getting a little thin so we changed the oil, put in a little bit and uh, now we're going to run into the store and try and finish working and composing on a couple of videos and maybe get one uploaded. So. We'll see how she runs and rides. Sounds a lot more stable than it was. It started to get in that little mad sewing machine thing going on. Let's ride. some work, work on some videos, I'm gonna go do my thing, y'all take care of each other and do your thing. See ya! Damn, that was annoying.